Barrett Browning was finally released after four years in jail for serving 63 months uh, and now has to pay close to $900,000 in restitution to Shafter. So, in case you're not familiar who Browning is, or Brown is, he is a writer, author, and works as a uh, an investigative journalism and satire. He's best known for an interview in the bathtub and was unofficially dubbed the PR for Anonymous, um, which actually wasn't actually completely true, but he did speak a lot regarding them, um, so people obviously made that link. In 2010, he created a Project PM, which was a crowdsource to talk about the leaked documents like those from Strafter. One of those investigations discovered was a plot by the Consortium of Intelligence Officers to discredit WikiLeaks um, and Grand Greenwald, obviously who was closely affiliated with WikiLeaks. He was arrested for lashing out and threatening FBI agents saying this, and this is what he quoted the saying, so it's not me saying it, it's just what he said, um, and I quote, Army officers of the US government and, pretend, and particularly the FBI were regarded as potential zealot assassin squads and the FBI and DPD, sorry, DPD know I'm armed and come from a military family that I was taught to shoot by a Vietnam vet by my father, a master hunter of all things. I will shoot them and kill them if they come and do anything because they engage in a criminal conspiracy and I have reason to fear for my life. Not just from the Zenits, but from the US government. He also added, and frankly, it'd be pretty obvious I'm going to be dead before I was 40, so I wouldn't mind going out with two FBI sidearms like fucking Egyptian pharaoh. Adios. Uh, now guys, obviously on Tuesday, WikiLeaks did go through and actually release over 60,000 of the emails regarding Browning's research on HP Grey. Um, and obviously the first thing he did when he got out was, Grab a Nag McMuffin from McDonald's. What else would you do? <laughs> Guys, so let, let me know what your thoughts are in the comment section below. Do you see Browning as a traitor or do you see him as a whistleblower slash hero? Let me know what your thoughts are in the comment section below. If this video has been helpful, please smack a like. If you're new to the channel, welcome and subscribe and don't forget to hit that bell. And apart from that, guys, I'll see you in the next video. Have a great day. And enjoy.